has to be in there. There was a prophet named Elijah. <laughs> this brother, he was the messenger of God and he was up on a mountain one day. And it was said the Lord is going to pass by. Right. What do you mean? The Lord was going to deal with the prophet. That's right. And the devil knew it. That's right. So the devil test. Yes, he did. The wisdom of the prophet. Yes, he did. By trying to imitate the deeds of God. That's right. To see can the prophet differentiate That's it. what was God That's it. and what was of the devil. That's right. Do you know the difference, brothers and sisters, from the devil's religion Jesus. and God? Amen. Follow me in the scriptures. In 1 Kings chapter 19 and at verse 11. 1 Kings 19.11. And he said, go forth, go forth, and stand upon the mount before the Lord. And? And behold, the Lord passed by. Who passed by? The Lord passed by. The Lord. The Lord God of creation. Amen. He passed by. And a great and strong wind rent the mountains. Now, if you just read that right away. Right away. And a great and strong wind rent the mountain, you would say right away, the Lord did it. That's right. Mm -mm. That's See, right. one place it told you the Lord passed by. Passed by. It didn't tell you he'd done anything yet. That's true. I guess let you know he was around. That's right. But he didn't do nothing yet. That's right. He's there observing, mm -hmm. watching, because he knew he was not the only one there. That's right. There was another source there that was against him. Amen. Listen closely at the language of the scriptures. And behold, the Lord passed by. The Lord passed by. And a great and strong wind rent the mountains. Great and strong wind rent the mountains. And, tore them up, shook them up. Mm -hmm. But what? And break in pieces the rocks before the Lord. A lot of activity. Right. It broke in pieces the rocks in whose presence? Before the Lord. Oh, the Lord didn't know it. That's right. Another spirit was busy while the Lord was observing. That's right. It was done before the Lord. Before, that's right. He was just watching. Amen. Watching that spirit and watching his prophet. That's right. Saying, is he going to move? Amen. Because the prophet was already told, you go up there. Yes. Because I'm coming. Right. But uh, I want you to be able to identify me. That's right. You got to have knowledge to properly identify truth. Go ahead. Go ahead brother. You got to have knowledge in order to identify the truth. That's right. That's right. A woman that's a wise shopper. She goes shopping for washers and dryers and refrigerators and microwaves and toasters and the whatnots. <laughs> she want to look at that fine writing. Oh, yes. When a company come to sell you insurance, you got to search around, but then you got to ask questions. Mm -hmm. You got to look at the fine writing. Right. If you can't see it, pull out some helpers. <laughs> Why? You don't want to be duped con later on. Amen. Before you declare loyalty yeah. to something, oh, yeah. Jesus said they error because they don't know the scriptures. the scriptures. Nor the power of God. Go into a religious building with a Bible on your arm don't mean nothing. No. Do you understand what's under your arm? That's right. Can you get and decipher and explain and interpret the book you carry in? That's right. The devil know that most church people are ignorant. Ignorant. To the book. Oh, yes. That's why he can con you. That's right. That's why he can duke you. Oh, yeah. That's why he can lie to you mm -hmm. and give you a hype 
and get you all ragged up. Yeah. The happier you get, the more loose your wallet get. That's right. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. But you don't ask no questions. Like I often say to news journalist Pierce Morgan, when he questioned mm -hmm. Joel Austin about homosexuality, mm -hmm. Pierce Morgan asked him, is it wrong according to the Bible? Yeah. Joel Austin, the cotton candy preacher. Yeah. He just said, well, well, I you know it's neither here nor there. <laughs> That's right. Pierce Morgan said, listen, according to the Bible, mm -hmm. homosexuality is wrong. Do you agree with that? He said, well, I, I, I have friends that are homosexual. Right then he confessed he's of the devil. That's right. Right then. Right then. Amen. Right then. Amen. Because a man mm -hmm. that's a real man don't run with homosexuals. No, they don't. No way. A man that's not an alcoholic don't hang with drunks. That's right. A man that's not a racist don't hang with bigots. Amen. That's right. A man of God don't have friends that men lay with men that men speak out against it. That's right. Go ahead, brother. Go the ahead. word said you can't get sweet and bitter water from the same fountain. That's right. When you truly walk with God, it brings about separation. Separation. Amen. Friends may not understand you. Yeah. But being that I want to walk with God now, my behavior starts to change. That's right. Huh? Amen. Don't go to the same clubs no more. No. Start to change. Oh, yes. They ain't smoking no more. Mm -hmm. Why? Start to change. Yeah. No more liquor. Mm -hmm. No more shooting pool. Yeah. No more rolling dice. Oh, yeah. Why? Starting to change. change. There is no such thing as a Christian homosexual. <laughs> no such thing. A Christian crackhead. My Lord. I shoot crack in the name of Jesus Christ. My Lord. Have you noticed they use the word Christian attached to anything? Anything. There's a gay parade going on here now in Harrisburg. And I guarantee you that a large percentage would say they're Christians. Christians. A man with a dress on. My a Lord. man with lipstick, a man with a wig, a man with makeup on his face. And some of you men that's in here get offended get because offended your brothers them. are like this, your daddies is like this, your uncles is like this, right. and you are like this on the down low. That's right. Am I right? Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Anytime anybody got a mind to truly serve God, the first thing that God does with us mm -hmm. is bring about a demolition crew. Yes, he will. He gives the prophets. That's right. And the apostles. And, the apostles. and said, destroy them. That's right. You go to the word. Go ahead. All these scriptures is against your character. Go ahead. Against your conduct. Mm. Against how you think. Amen. Against what you want to do. Go ahead. And God say, now surrender. Yeah. Give me your will. That's it. Lord, what do you want from me? What do you want me to do? Give me your mind. Give me your heart. That's right. Give me your hands. Give me your head. Amen. Give me the members of your body. Go ahead, brother. Hallelujah. Go ahead. Go to God. Go ahead. God, God is calling for the whole you. That's it. Why you? What you think it means? Hallelujah. You're not your own. Hallelujah. You're bought with the price. With the price. You don't belong to yourself. That's right. You belong to the Most High. Amen.
Come on, let's finish up Elijah. Everybody all right? Amen. Amen. Listen. And behold, the Lord passed by. The Lord passed by. And a great and strong wind rent the mountains. And? And break in pieces the rocks before the Lord. What else? But the Lord was not in the wind. But yet he passed by. Passed by. And all this activity took place. Mm -hmm. But the Lord wasn't in it. And after the wind. After the wind. An earthquake. Oh. Amen. There was a lot of activity going on. Mm -hmm. To see can the problem. What was the devil objective? I want to see can I move this man of God. That's right. See because Elijah had knowledge. Mm -hmm. He was able to distinguish. What's God. Mm -hmm. And what was not. That's right. The purpose of the truth of God telecast. If you watch it, I promise you, you will learn more by the telecast than all your years mm -hmm. going to church. Amen. God sent this preacher to open your eyes. Open your eyes. Turn you from darkness to light. That's right. From the power of Satan unto God. That's it. It's a beautiful thing when a blind man's eyes come open. Oh, yeah. When a blind woman's eyes come open. That's right. Jesus said, Blessed are your eyes. For they see. For now they see. They see. When your understanding come open, mm -hmm. the opening of an understanding brings about mixed emotion. Yeah. It brings joy. And anger. That's true. You're joyful because now you understand. Mm -hmm. You angry because you looked at the time you waste and the years you were being robbed. That's right. And the amount of lies you was being told. Amen. Here you were sincere mm -hmm. and loyal. Mm -hmm. You think some of the things I preach, these men don't know? A lot of them lot know of, it. But of because them. it won't make them money, right. because they can't get rich. Because right. they can't get a mansion or a car as a result of it. They say, I won't preach it. Won't preach it. That's right. So they'd rather give you a bunch of trash. That's right. Look at the neighbor and say, neighbor, you own the good food. <laughs> My Lord. My Lord. They'd rather tell you, get up. And when I count to three, mm. stomp on the floor. Right. We're going to stomp on the devil's head. The devil don't feel that. No, no. No. Go ahead. Gimmicks, Gimmicks, schemes. Mm -hmm. Why, if any of us is from the hood along with myself, mm -hmm. we all know what a hustle is. That's right. You cannot deny the fact church is the biggest hustle, biggest hustle. in the world. Amen. Go ahead. Are right, you listening to the old man? Go ahead. Listen. And after the wind and earthquake. After the wind, now the devil come along and brought an earthquake. But the Lord was not in the earthquake. But the Lord didn't do it. That's right. What else? And after the earthquake. After the earthquake. A fire. Look at the devil is busy. Amen. A fire. But the Lord was a not. A form mm -hmm. of anointing. A form. That's right. Fire came. That's right. But what was the result? But the Lord was not in the fire. Brothers and sisters. Hmm. The activity that is going on yeah. can you differentiate can you distinguish mm -hmm. whether God is in it, in it or is it the moving of the devil that's it the preacher that is in the pulpit with a written out text that's right and then he loses pages and then just blood out of tongue uh, <laughs> that's right how can these men like Robert Tilton mm. get on television for one and two and three hours mm -hmm. and beg you for money. Beg you for money. And then tell you, wait a minute, wait a minute, here it come, here it come. Also, 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 there it is. Here it is. There it is. If, if, if you didn't understand, the Lord just said 50,000, 50,000. <laughs> That's right. 50, there it is again. There it is 50, again. 50,000. You a sucker. Amen. Go ahead, brother. You being duped. Oh, yes. It shows you how men don't fear God. That's right. That they will use God to rob the world. That's right. Steal my words. And we, as money lovers, yeah. we want the money so bad. I've seen preachers hmm. 
tell the viewing audience, get a piece of paper, trace your hand. Yes, they will. Cut it out and send it to me. That's right. He said, when I get it, I'm going to put my hand yeah. on your hand. Yeah. And we're going to touch, touch and agree. And agree. <laughs> That's right. My Lord. And we fall for this gimmick. Yeah. 